Yo, it's your boy Letty here and I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys this workaround for the Cardi Car Merge and GTA Online for every console right now at the moment. But if you guys want to be in the next video like these lovely people on the screen, just simply make sure you like the video and subscribe with post notifications on because 92% of you guys are not subscribed. Also, don't forget about that modded account I'm giving away for PlayStation only at the moment. So let's keep running up these videos and everything. But let's get into today's sponsor. Before we get into the video, check out extramods.com. They have GTA services such as modded accounts, money boosting, and level boosting. And you can get a 5% off discount when you use code SAVAGE. So the link will be in the description below. Let's get back to the video. So the first thing you want to do is come to the LS car meet with the vehicle you want the modifications from. You want to start a sprint. Once you start the sprint, you just don't want to pull up your phone and you want to call your mechanic as soon as you start the sprint. So once you call your mechanic and the menu pops up in the left hand corner, you just want to join Anawak or anybody in the private different targeting mode session. So I'm just going to join Anawak and I want to accept the first alert and sit on the second alert. So like I said, I'm just about to join Anawak right now and I'm going to accept the first alert and I'm just going to sit on the second alert. Once I'm sitting on the second alert, I'm just going to be listening in the background for when the race actually starts. So you're going to be able to notice when the race actually starts in the background. You're going to hear the, the countdown. So once you hear the race start in the background, you just want to press circle on that alert. And you'll notice in the left hand corner, you should have the menu bar. It should be like a black bar in the left hand corner like you can see on my screen right now. What you want to do, you just want to wait for the race to start. Once the race starts, you just want to hold triangle or Y on Xbox to respawn. Once you respawn, you just want to press down on the D-pad. And you want to go to that garage where that vehicle you want to put the modifications on is located. So I'm just about to mod the new demon that just has came out. So I'm just going to hold triangle and as soon as the red bar gets to the end, I'm just going to spam the X or A. Once I spam X or A, I should load with the vehicle. If you don't hit it the first shot, you can just keep doing this over and over again until you hit it. As long as you still have the vehicle menu in the left hand corner. So I'm just going to try it again. Gonna hold triangle or Y. As soon as it gets to the end, I'm gonna spam X or A. And I didn't hit it that time either. So I'm gonna try it again, and I did happen to hit it this time. I'm gonna hold triangle or Y and spam X or A once the red gets to the end. If you die like me, you just wanna simply join Anawak and you wanna accept the first alert and decline the second alert again. So like I said, you're going to accept the first alert and decline the second one. And by the way, this only works for current gen this way. But you just want to simply go down to Criminal Enterprise. Then you want to click on the 1337. And then you want to press X or A on this screen right here. It's going to take you to the location to purchase. And you just want to hold triangle or Y to respawn. Once you respawn, you should respawn inside of the vehicle you wanted the modifications on. It's that simple and that easy. But from here, you just want to end the race and save this vehicle by going inside of the Los Santos Customs or the LS car meet. So to end the race, you just want to simply join Anawak or whoever you joined before. So you just want to join them and you want to accept all of the alerts that appears on your screen. So every alert that appear on your screen, you just want to simply accept all of those alerts. Or you can have your blue jobs on the map and you can go up to the left hand corner like I do and just start this job to end it so i'm just about to start the job again because it doesn't let you do it the first time so you want to start the job once you're inside of the job you just want to bag out and then the race should be ended but you can do either of those ways to end the race but from here once you come back down or once you end the race period you just want to drive it to the ls customs or into the ls car meet to change something on the vehicle to save the vehicle so now I'm just about to get inside of my vehicle and I'm about to drive it inside of the LS car meet because that's how I want to save it. So like I said, you just want to change anything on the vehicle or you can upgrade it however you like it. Just make sure not to scratch the vehicle if you're into modded cars and trading. That's only up to you. But I just like to change the custom plates and stuff. 
just look at the upgrades and stuff so just, as long as you change one thing on it you have saved this vehicle but from here you can just bag out and you can rinse and repeat the steps over again to merge another car but yeah that's pretty much the glitch that's pretty much the workaround there's really nothing new you just want to join and whack as soon as you see the mechanic list in the left hand corner but you know it's your boy bloody here and i'm gonna continue to drop these bangers for you but you already know everybody stay positive keep that positive mindset and i'll see you guys in the next one peace